The coronavirus outbreak has brought about a surge in demand for products to help health care providers protect themselves and their patients. 16 News Now reporter Ibrahim Samra, working from home, uh, joins us now with how one local fashion designer is looking to turn that all around. Ibrahim. Well, Terry, a lot of us, uh, like our viewers, are working from home, and that's also the same case for Mishawaka fashion designer Paris Joe Thomas. She actually comes from a family full of nurses, and she knows just how much first respondents need uh, face masks, so she's decided to make some of her own. I've been sewing since I was eight. My mom taught me how to hand sew. Paris Joe Thomas is a stay-at-home fashion designer in a stay-at-home world. I am a fashion designer. I have um, my own business that I'm working on. I've been building it since 2016 when I graduated. A business full of custom prom dresses, wedding gowns, and now fashionable face masks for first responders. I'm definitely wanting to donate um, to the local hospitals, uh, South Bend, Mishawaka area. The masks are made up of a 100% con reversible shell and a sewn-in non-woven filter, making it the next best alternative to surgical masks, according to the CDC. Um, the 100% cotton, according to the CDC, is the best protection barrier against the droplets and the virus with like up to 70% protection. The idea came from Paris's mother. This is really difficult. A nurse at Memorial hospital who helps when she can because she too knows just how scarce these masks can be so this is personal these are these are not just nurses and doctors these are my friends and she didn't hesitate one moment to say yes I'll do it Paris says she's determined to help nurses like her mother no matter how many masks it takes even if it's 15 if it's 30 if it's 50 hopefully we can do that just I'm just gonna keep making them since I'm in the home <laughs> right now we can't leave but yeah, I'm just going to do my best to get them out to everyone. And uh, if you're at home and if you want to purchase any masks, she's actually going to be selling them as well. You can buy one for eight bucks. I actually bought three of them. Uh, but in the meantime, she said she's going to focus on donating as much as she can as possible. And, of course, if you want to contact her or place an order, uh, you can actually head to her Facebook page at Parish Joe or her Instagram. And, of course, we have that information on our website, and you can click on this story. Terry, we send it back to you in the studio. All right, and it proves that, uh, you know, being safe these days is quite fashionable. All right, Ibrahim, thank you very much.